Today, we're going to show you how we apply the first coat of the Maloof Poly Oil. The audio didn't record properly, so I'm going to have to overdub the best I can here. My apologies. We wear black rubber gloves and use shop towels to apply the oil. You could also use old socks or t-shirts. They work just as well. You'll want to apply a liberal amount of oil to your project and let it soak in for a minute or so. Then wipe off the excess. Anything that gets into the nooks or crannies can be blown out with an air compressor. We'll let our project sit overnight and apply a second and sometimes third coat over the next day or two. For indoor signs, typically one or two coats seems to be sufficient, but you could always do what suits your taste. Sam Maloof once said, One of the most important aspects of finishes, I believe, is that they invite me to touch, to caress, and to take pleasure in the wood surface. We couldn't agree more. We get nothing but compliments from our work and how nice it is to touch as well as look at. If you're not familiar with this blend, Amazon describes it as a custom blend of polyurethane varnish and natural oils developed by Sam Maloof to beautifully finish his finest pieces, ideal for use on furniture, cabinets, and millwork, and enlivens wood grain and adds warmth to its color. It will give your project the look of hand-rubbed satin finish in half the time it takes using pumice and rotten stone. As you can see, it really turns out well on walnut. We've used it on maple, lubinga, mahogany, and cherry. Thanks for stopping by and checking out our video. Thank you.